So uh, you can have a really small gable like this, or if you wanted to have a larger gable, uh, we can edit these edges again. So I'm gonna click on this edge and this edge over here, and I'm gonna hit enter. Shorten this distance, okay? So what if we made this 12 inches, which is one foot? I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side, 12 inches, which is one foot. We hit OK. You'll notice that it moves it back some and it is now much larger. OK. And of course, it shortens the hip on both sides. So the first roof we want to look at is the Dutch hip roof. This roof is a combination of a hip roof and a gable roof together. All right. So the first thing we're going to do is to find the roof command, which is on your home tab on the build panel. We click on the drop down here and we have the roof tool. We want to start with the roof tool here. So you click on that. And of course, the tool is ready to go. We have some properties that we can adjust, but we'll leave those for last. Uh, why don't we start in this corner of the roof and we'll go over to the next corner. And typically, uh, you would go all around the perimeter of the building. So I'm going to click on my third corner here. And immediately you can see that the hip roof is starting to form. And as soon as I click on my last point, I have a completed hip roof. And all I have to do here is to hit enter to finish the command. Immediately, if we go into 3D view here, you can see that we have a three dimensional hip roof. So once you have a hip roof, it's just a matter of uh, creating that little gable at the end here and another one on this end. So to do that, we would click on edit edges. Once you do that, you want to pick the two sides that you want to work on. So in this case, it's going to be this side. And then I'm going to come over and click on this side. Once that happens, you hit enter. And this will take you into the roof edges and faces dialog. Click on my first edge, I'll come down to faces and to add it one, I simply click inside and the second one is added. Now I want the slope for this one to be 90 degrees and that is gonna be able to give us the gable end that we are looking for. And we need to specify a distance here as well. We're gonna make this three feet. For the second one, we'll do the same thing. Click again to add a second face to our second edge. And once we do that, we're gonna do the same thing. We put 90 degrees and we will add three feet in here as our height. And once you're done, that is it, okay? And look at that, we now have a Dutch hip roof. So if we click on the front view here, just to rotate it and take a look at it, you can see where it comes up on a hip and then you have the gable 